let's continue by uh, revise back uh, so you know that the natural numbers is the subset of the whole numbers and the whole number is a subset of the integers number uh, integers and later subset to the rational numbers uh, the number getting bigger and bigger right the, num the, the types of numbers here so lastly it will be the real number system right uh, and don't forget that the real numbers is formed from the irrational the, the rational numbers includes with the irrational numbers uh, to form a system of real numbers right uh, so and so I'm going to sketch a Venn diagram for this Venn diagram so I have a Venn diagram I have a Venn diagram you know Venn diagram right? uh, the universal set will be your real numbers okay uh, the real numbers the real numbers is consists right uh, the real numbers so means all inside here will be your real numbers so and definitely the rational numbers uh, will include all the rational numbers in the bigger set we know that rational numbers uh, the rational numbers together with the irrational numbers right uh, the rational numbers and the irrational numbers will form the real number right? uh, will form the real number system so now you can say that the smallest num uh, the set of number will be the counting numbers the natural numbers uh, natural numbers followed by natural number the difference between natural number and the whole number is just a zero right uh, so natural numbers include in the whole number system and the whole number system is included in the integers numbers right uh, the integers numbers so the integers numbers and the integers is included in the rational numbers right and the rational numbers all this is the rational numbers combined with outside the rational numbers irrational number will form the real number system okay uh, so very simple so uh, this if you want to represent it in the form of Venn diagram uh, this is the uh, this is the Venn diagram that fit the subset uh, the, 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 rela the relationship here all right okay let's see if you want to represent this in the form of flow chart also okay all right you want to represent in the form of flow charts you know that uh, real numbers right uh, the largest number will be the real numbers the real numbers the real numbers consist of rational number and irrational number so when you explain you know that real numbers is consist of Rational numbers, rational numbers, uh, and irrational numbers, irrational numbers. So then you know that these two numbers combined are forming the real numbers, right? But under the rational numbers, you still have integers right uh, integers some will further divide into the integers or non-integers right uh, integers and non-integers right uh, so means that uh, for example the rational number can be formed to integers and non-integers uh, so actually integers and non-integers Integers and non-integers when they form they, they combine they were forming irrational numbers. Uh, what is mean by non-integers? For example, a number that has decimal values. Okay, uh, integers is a number. Uh, integers is a number that uh, negative uh, negative five negative four right uh, negative five negative four. Uh, okay, I I writing here. So integers is a can be negative 5, negative 4, negative 3, negative 2, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 right? uh, This is the integers right? In between the integers, there is a value For example, in between 0 and 1, it can be 0 0.2 Between 2 and 3, it can be 2.4 right? uh, So this is integers This is integers uh, Non-integers means Non-integers means some of the number in rational number, for example, 3 over 2, right? 3 over 2 is between 1 and 2, right? 1 and 2, 1.5, right? 1.5 is, is 
non integers uh, non integers but is an uh, means that is it, it can be right in the form of fraction right it's a rational number these two is a rational number the difference is uh, can, inside the rational number can be some part of it is integer and part of it is non integers for example uh, all this number uh, all this number that can that decimal form right uh, in the decimal form so it's non integers right uh, but actually if you combine these two it's as a rational rational numbers okay uh, that's the difference you want to further split this so and under the integers we have what uh, means that the whole numbers right uh, the whole numbers so the whole numbers is belong to the integer numbers right uh, and the inside the whole numbers there is a natural number okay uh, there is a natural number so it means that this is the largest num set of number right uh, which consists of rational and irrational number inside the rational number consists of integers and non integers and under the integers it consists of whole numbers and whole numbers consist of natural numbers so this is uh, the flow chart to represent the relationship uh, for this sets of numbers all right okay that's all for this video hope you understand the relationship of all the sets of numbers